Arno. Can't I go with you, father? Courage, my boy. You wait just here. I will return when this hand reaches the top. That's forever. Not as long as all that. And when I get back, we'll see the fireworks. And Arno, no exploring, hmm? Yes, father. away now do you know what the penalty is for stealing Did you see their faces when we stole those apples? <laughs> I'm Arno. Elise. I'm here with my father. So am I. He has important business with the king. What should we do now? Shh. Listen. Don't worry, they'll never think to look for us in here. It was my fault. I'm the one who took the apple. Let's see where they're going. Hurry, something's happened. I sincerely hope this unfortunate affair does not darken your opinion of our nation. Monsieur, if we judged nations by the character of their hey, criminals, Father? we should all be called Come parents. here, girl, now. Father?
Look at me. Card, so you stooped the thieving, you bastard! Calm down, Victor. I've only come for my watch. It's my watch. I want it fairly. Well, in a just world, Victor, I would agree with you, but this is not a just world. This is France. You're a dead man. Oh, step lightly there. You'll hurt yourself. Ah! I just had a nice chat with your brother. You go. Fetch the marshals. Hold on a minute. Diable. I've got it, Victor. Oh. I say. Sorry. Like you probably can't even read or watch. Come over here and say that. Uh, no. Get back here. Over there. Ne parlez-vous de lui? I'm gonna smash your skull oh. in the face. Where do you think you're climbing oh, on? Yes. A wise man knows when to admit defeat, Victor. And where in God's name have you been? Ha! Huh. Got you now, you little shit! Just a little misunderstanding. Nothing to... Your master's arboring a common criminal. In broad daylight, he broke into my home and stole my watch. Did he indeed? Well, I'm sure the Marshal C would be more than willing to sort this out. Sort what out, Olivier? Uh, a most serious accusation against your ward, sir. He robbed me. <laughs> of what, precisely? Wait for me in my library. Don't give me that look. Victor cheats when he plays Pharaoh. Everyone knows it. Arno? Who are you talking to? No one, monsieur. You'll be happy to learn I persuaded Olivier to leave off calling the Marshalsea. Again. Je vous remercie, monsieur. What is this? The sixth time? The seventh? Perhaps a new hobby might be better for your health. Well, I find playing cards affords many opportunities for fresh air and exercise. <laughs> we'll talk about this later. I have business in town and must collect Elise before I can attend to it. Elise is here? Only for the night. She returns to Paris first thing tomorrow. She'll need an escort. Won't she with you so preoccupied? One of you running amok is quite enough. Remain here and see if Olivier has any chores for you. Sure he does. What was that? Give my regards to Elise.
thrown out onto the street yet? Oh, you would love that, wouldn't you? It'd break my heart. Olivier, if I weren't here, who'd do all your work for you? The horses need brushing, boy. Get to it. Certainement, monsieur. Tire de la serre, wait! Nom de Dieu. Nom de Dieu, nom de Dieu. Some trouble, mon ami. A letter for Sire de la Serre. It's very important. Oh, calm yourself, Perrault. That letter won't reach Monsieur de la Serre any faster if you drop dead of exhaustion. Give it here. I'll catch you. You must receive it today. It's very... Very important. Yes, I heard you the first time. I'll see that he gets it. Monsieur de la Serre! Stop! Bad luck, lad. You'll have to go make around. Make way, make way! All over. What was that? Damn it, slow down! Apparently, Walnut is a popular finish this season. Who is driving this coach, Pelops? Monsieur de la Serre! Please excuse, wrong carriage. I need is a bird's eye view. There you are.
You're not allowed. Move away. Move back, or I'll move you myself. Tu dois être si tourmenté. Je ne peux pas vous toucher à un cheveu de Mathurin. Ne t'en fais pas pour nous. Il n'osera pas nous dénoncer. Il ne pourra plus parler pendant longtemps, de toute façon. Je suis assuré d'avance que vous me proposerez les moyens les plus efficaces pour y établir un ordre permanent et affirmer le crédit public. Grand et salutaire ouvrage qui a 
et sa considération au dehors nous occupera essentiellement. So, who or what will take its place? Another king? A council of capable men? That is the question, isn't it? A truce, then. What the devil was that about? Oh! Now, now, we can resolve this without recourse to violence, can't we? Get him, Hugo! I suppose not. Victor. To your health, gentlemen. You, boy, stop! What are you doing there? Uh, running! Bonsoir, Olivier. Has Monsieur de la Serre returned? Seigneur de la Serre is not expected until late. Ah, well. I suppose I'll just pass the time with Elise, then. Don't get your hopes up just yet. Mademoiselle is at a private soiree, in her honor, at the palace. A party? I wasn't invited. Neither were the horses. <laughs> I'm sure she just misplaced my invitation. I'll find my own way in. How late is late? Perhaps an hour, perhaps three, perhaps not at all. I do not question the comings and goings of my betters. I'll just wait here then. Elise never enjoyed these high society balls. She'll be home soon. Le Traité du Monde et de la Lumière de Descartes. Never could get through that one. 
I could just slip it under the door. He'd see it the instant he returned. and sound, and only slightly delayed. And now, to the palace. Ugh. I couldn't sneak through a sewer in these threads, much less a ball. Here, here, mon ami. Let me take care of that. Uh, well, thank you, young man. Maximilien Robespierre. No guest. Ah, no. Le Chevalier du Telem. Invitation, s'il vous plaît. About that, I had one, of course, but on the way... No invitation, no admittance. Now clear the queue. Next, please. Charles Gabriel Sivet. Two guests. Next, please. Quite the turnout. Quite!
Look at that one. Pretty sure his shoes cost more than my rent. If I do, what? Certainly not. Well, then, if it's all the same to you, I think I'll stay up here. time we were all together like this. It must have been that business when uh... M'accorderiez-vous cette danse pour gentilhomme? Merci. Un autre jour. I did love the chase. You seem to have caused quite a commotion. Well, what can I say? You were always a bad influence. Oh, you were a worse one. Father's suit. <laughs> Are you wearing a dress? Oh, don't even start. I feel like a mummy wrapped up in this thing. Must be quite an occasion to get you so fancy. It's not like that. Truth be told, it's a lot of ceremony and pontification. Dull as dirt. Well, when you don't invite me to your parties, everyone suffers. I did try, but my father was adamant. Your father? Who's in there? Who's Go. I'll distract them. What? You're kicking me out? It's complicated. I'll explain later, but for now, out the window. Oh, no, no, no. You're not turning this into a repeat of that apple orchard. Stop being such a baby. I'm sure there aren't any guard dogs this time. Go! Not an antelope, an interloper, a suspicious person. Have you seen anyone like that? Hmm. Oh, there was Madame de...
Waste of time. There's nobody out here. Who's even going to come out here? Ten to one I end the night cleaning a rich man's vomit off my shoes. Several of these. You're right, Monsieur. Too much of the King's champagne. Monsieur. Monsieur de la Serre. Monsieur de la Serre. Sylvain, come away. Guards! Help! Murder! Bon Dieu! He's killed Lord de la Serre! 